So as you know by the title of this video, I'm getting my hair done. I'm on my way to my appointment now. I'm going to be bringing you along as much as possible. And then I'm also going to be filming my family's reaction. I think it'll be funny because we've thrown, we've thrown his mother off the scent a bit and so I'm really excited to see her reaction. She knows I'm doing something to my hair but she doesn't know what and she doesn't think it's going to be anything drastic so this is I think it's going to be hilarious. You did a good job of making her think it's minor. It wouldn't yeah. be easily noticeable. Yeah. So sorry about that Ma. Because <laughs> I know you're watching. And in order to throw her off the scent, I told her that I didn't want to tell anybody because I didn't. I, I wanted to see if they would notice. <laughs> that threw her off for sure. But then I have a feeling that she is definitely either going to call me a brat or a little twit. Yep. Let's go with twit. She's going to call me a little twit. <laughs> Hi. Okay. I'm cutting in here. I have my hair covered so you don't see the final result just yet. But. As you can tell by the title of this video, this was a hair fail, so there was no fun reaction to film of the family. So that did not happen. You'll see why in a minute, but I just wanted to just wanted to say none of that excitement, none of that happened, and I'm very disappointed. But I did ask my sister-in-law, and she agreed that she would have called me a twit, so I was right. Okay, as you can see, it is not blonde. <sighs> Does it look anything like this to you? No. It's a week later, so like <laughs> a lot of my frustration has already come out and I'm, I'm fine now. I didn't get what I wanted, if you can't tell. I'll show you some pictures now. It was very, very gray in the beginning. It's not quite as bad now, but a whole lot happened. We messaged the hairstylist and it was a misunderstanding somehow. And she's going to fix it free of charge today. So, I really don't fully know how a misunderstanding happened. Since she did so many highlights up top that I didn't want, I'm now thinking that maybe one of these two is gonna be more like it. Oh, I don't know. I honestly have no idea what to expect. I also don't love, like, I don't love the color of it. I don't love the color of the blonde. I don't like the style that it was done, and it's not what I asked for. And honestly, like, it's not even. Like, there's a big stripe here. Nothing. Stripes on the side. It's just, it wasn't done great, even if this was what I asked for. But enough complaining. We're going to get it fixed. Let's do it. I'm getting real sick of this. This is not what I wanted. <laughs> Twice, and she didn't do it correctly. This woman has 40 years of experience and owns her own salon and cannot do hair to save her life. A refresher, here's the picture. Here's what I have, not the same thing. And I'm so frustrated, first of all, it's not the same style in the sense of the ombre mostly dark up here and it getting lighter to the ends and the ends being super light. Also, the color of the blonde. What is this? This is not, it's not it. 
she didn't really do the you know money piece that is a good style and kind of comes with this style of highlighting. If you see in the back there's like this really weird stripe kind of thing where it's just like a harsh line and a big chunk of blonde. Don't know what that's all about but I'm very disappointed and this is what I would consider an epic fail. So if it wasn't for money I would go somewhere else and be like you know fix this. At least get me the color blonde that I want but I can't afford that right now. I do want to go to another salon, at least talk to them and tell them what happened and ask them what it would take to get this right, at least the color right, and then how much that would cost so I can kind of plan for it. So hopefully I can have a hair transformation redo video or something like that where I can get this done correctly the way I want, but this ain't it. So that that ends this hair transformation going from brunette to blonde fail. I'm not saying it's an ugly color because some people's hair is this color. I just do not like this color with my skin tone. It's more of like a sandy blonde, which is fine if that's what you're going for. That's just not what I was going for at all. And I just don't think it's really great for my skin tone. It's a little too warm. I'm cool skin tone. I want it little I wanted it a little icier and it's not. So I'm done complaining. It could be a lot worse. At least I still have my hair. It didn't burn off or anything. So that's always a good thing. Thanks so much for watching. Stay tuned for part two when I get this fixed because I am going to get this fixed someday. If you enjoy affordable hair, fashion, beauty related content, then be sure to subscribe so that you get notified every time I post a video. If you enjoy this, please be sure to give it a like and I will see you next time.